Our other top story tonight, take a look at your screen. Incredible video showing an early morning house fire in York County. Three people forced from their homes and one firefighter had to be taken to the hospital. Now the Red Lion community is coming together to rally behind those who were affected. Thanks for joining us at 5 on your Friday. I'm Jasmine Brooks. Hey, I'm Joel D. Smith. So these images behind us showed all that damage right here. And it's all that's left now of that home in Red Lion. CBS 21's Maxine Rose in York County. She joins us live with how you can help those affected. Maxine. Yeah, Jasmine Joldi, I want you to take a look behind me here. You can see crews have obviously left the scene now at this point, but the the windows have been boarded up and you can see how badly burned this back half of this house off of South Main Street burned. You can see all of the scorched items that sit back here in this backyard and neighbors say that it really was shocking to watch it all last night. Now, dispatch tells us that the fire started around 1.20 this morning and neighbor Michelle Rill tells us a family member had heard popping noises like gunshots. They then stepped outside and watched in disbelief as the fire burned through the home. They called 911 and shortly thereafter, crews from the Alliance Fire and Rescue worked to put out the fire. She says her neighbor, who she believes is roughly 70 years old, lives with two other roommates. Now this is all that's left. For Johnny and his roommates, you know, if the community can come together and help as much as possible, you know, we can provide some sort of small relief. I lived through a house fire back in 1999, so I know how detrimental it could be. As for the injured firefighter from Alliance Fire and Rescue, they were taken to the hospital but have since been released. Rill says she saw that her neighbor Johnny had blisters all down his back, but dispatch says no other injuries were reported. We will also speak to other neighbors in the community as well. Uh, we saw Rill has still been out here looking at what is left here. We'll talk about what the community is doing to help Johnny and those roommates. But for now, I'll send it back to you.